welcome to Crafty Island. In today's video I'm going to show you how you can make fish out of using cupcake holders or coffee filters. So let's get started. Okay in order to make our cupcake fish we need either you can use a coffee filter if your mom has one or a cupcake holder and then you need construction paper. I picked pink and some red scraps that I had for the tails and we're going to glue it on a blue piece to make it look like they're swimming in the ocean. And then you'll also need some markers and some glue and some scissors. So let's get started. We're going to start by coloring in the fish. And you guys could use paint if you had it if your mom would let you or you could use stickers. Whatever you want to decorate it with. I'm going to decorate it with markers. So I think with this one I'm going to give it some orange stripes. So you can use whatever colors. You could even use crayons if you wanted to. However you want to decorate it, it's up to you. And maybe some of you might have um, the little cupcake holders at home that are already decorated. I've seen them at the store where they're already pink with polka dots or purple. If you already have colored ones, you wouldn't need to color them all. You could just um, put the eye on it and a smiley face and glue it on the paper. So now we're going to give it an eye. Or if you had googly eyes, you could even put a googly eye on there if you wanted to. And we'll give him a smiley face. Okay, and now the other fish I'm going to do polka dots. Okay, now I gotta give this fish an eye and a smiley face. Okay, so now I'm gonna get my blue paper back. And I'm gonna start by putting glue on the back of my big fish. So I'm gonna turn it over. Put some glue around the edges. And then press that one down on the paper. And then put some glue on the other one. And then I got to give them some tails. So I'm going to get that scrap paper I had and I'll make a big um, well first I'll start with the little one. I'll make a little tail with this one. I'll have a pink tail. And just make a small triangle on your paper. And then put a little glue on the tip.
And then we need a tail for the big one. So I just make another triangle, just a bigger one. And it's okay if the tail goes off the paper a little bit or covers up the other one. However you want to do it. This is a smaller piece of paper, so we could have just did one fish, but I wanted to show you if you had a cupcake holder or a coffee filter, it would work for both. And then we can even take a blue marker and make some bubbles that are coming up from that small fish. Okay, so that's it. It's that simple. I hope you guys enjoyed doing that craft, and I'll see you next time on Crafty Island.